black hoodie, I'm back cooking these goodies. Look at these views from cooking these foods. Yeah. Hello and welcome, beautiful people of the internet world. Today, you are partaking with me in Black Hoodie's 2019 Burger Shootout Extravaganza, fulfilling childhood fantasies one day at a time. So, these are the options. I got them here. Let's talk about them. This is what I have to go with being in Canada. I don't have all these other amazing American places that I would love to do this with, but this is what I had to work with. So, a and W. Teen Burger. We got the Whopper, Burger King, we got the Big Mac, McDonald's, and we have Dave's Bacon Deluxe from Wendy's. So we got Wendy's, McDonald's, Burger King, and W going head to head in a battle, and we're going to see who reigns supreme and victorious. Okay? And uh, I'm very, very into this video. All right. So the gang's all here. Before we do anything more, we must pour. Iceberg, on deck, DP, hello. You guys, when I say this is a childhood fantasy, I very much, very much mean it. I'm way too excited for it. We got some things to talk about. Can't wait to sink my teeth into all these delightful creations from the fast food world. But until then, we fountain of youth. We fizz. And we stand. A good burger and a good fizz face. There's one thing we don't need to shoot out. Is Dr. Pepper. Because we already know. It's top tier. Okay. What do we have? What are we looking at here? Iconic moments is really what we are looking at. But the Dave's Bacon Deluxe, the Mac Attack, the WAP, Teen Burger. Interesting point is the price point. So this was $7. Big Mac was $7. Whopper was $7.67. Team Burger was seven fifty. Okay, so immediately what I'm noticing is burgers are increasingly expensive. Now this is Canada, so we pay a buttload for everything up here in terms of food. Uh, down south in the old down under, down in America, you guys have it made in the shade when it comes to your food scene because you guys have cheap food, which I'm very jealous of. But. Uh, Ain't nothing to it, but to do it. So we're going to work from right to left. We're going to start with Wendy's. And uh, immediately what I'm noticing is the Wendy's A&W and Big Mac are similar size in terms of the bun. The Wendy's, though, is like a brioche style bun. You can have a look there. So this is lettuce, tomato, pickles, onion. Was supposed to have bacon. And they ripped me off. They didn't put bacon. So the universe was looking out for me in terms of it just being their regular burger. I got screwed, but oh well. We're going to attack these like burgers should be attacked. I was thinking of cutting them in half, but that wouldn't be burger purist. Okay, so Wendy's, it's very saucy. This burger in particular. I'm a fan of Wendy's. I like it. It's good. Is it blowing me away? No, not particularly. I want these two to go head to head. So actually, I'm going to make a jump move 
over to the teen burger. And what I have to say about the teen burger upon observation is that in terms of presentation, this bad boy, in W U O N, you take the W for your presentation as of right now with these burgers. Because that to me looks advertiser friendly, it looks like the commercial, and it makes me want to eat it. Mm. They're not lying when they say Bacon makes everything better The Wendy's burger was supposed to have bacon So We're kind of at a disadvantage there But I will say damn This a &W burger This team burger is firing all cylinders and you know what just look at the construction of it it's perfect it's layered perfectly everything's in there nice this bite this middle bite in particular is going to be very very good mm. i like how a and w is not afraid of mustard either burger is very mustard forward but i like it a and w is hitting right now that's gonna be tough to beat all right here we go the big show the main event sunday 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 <clears throat> mac attack and the whopper this Mac, I gotta say, whoever made it did a good job. It's looking nice. I cannot lie. It looks well composed, <clears throat> like a Mozart song. Mmm. McDonald's buns have a certain like plush, soft, squishy nature. That I can get on board for. Once again, this is a nice Mac, whoever made it was on point. It does help that I that I got there at the lunch rush. It was about eleven thirty. And that's when everything's freshest. So I'm hitting these all at a at a fresh lunch rush date. But the Mac it's the Mac for a reason. Just such an iconic flavor. It's its own unique thing. The Mac sauce is magical. This is good, but this is better. Why? I can't really say it. It's just because it's a Big Mac, because it's, it's its own unique thing, you know? And now we go into my, what I deem usually as my favorite burger fast food wise and that's the whoppy but here's the thing look at how much bigger this thing is than everything else that's one thing you definitely get with the whopper it is a more substantial burger let's get into it Yep. 
right in there. Mm. That's a bite right there. That middle guy. That's the one. That's just home for me. That's where I live. Yep. So, I guess we have to rank them. And I think from my reaction from the Whopper, you guys probably know where it stands but we'll go from last to first place as I addictively eat this Whopper it's so magical okay in last place Wendy's. It's not there for me. In a weird, reluctant to give it third place is the teen burger. <clears throat> and why I'm reluctant is because it's actually a very good burger. Like, not... Enough can't be said for the team burger. Like, it's very, very good. A&W's quality. Unfortunately, the Big Mac just has that special feeling to it. That can't be... That can't be played with. It's just good in its own unique way. So I'm sorry, sir, but you, sir, reign over you. And then, of course, of course, but maybe, Louis C.K. This is where I live, this is my house, this is my home, this is where I retire. My 401k plan right here, baby. This is a Whopper. 100% my absolute favorite something about the way that the like that just that flame grilled patty the way that the mayo and the ketchup and the tomato all work together. And then when you get the pickle and the acidity cuts through all the fat of their mayo, it's a win-win situation. And that's why it got finished just now. And also, look at that. That's the result of a Whopper. None of these gave this. And that right there, ladies and gents, is why a Whopper is magical. Lots of sauce. Very juicy. Just completely extra delicious. You know?
So that's where we end these th this thing. It was amazing. I think I did a pretty good job on actually eating a lot of the burgers. I didn't think I would be able to get through that much. And that's it for me. That's 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 my that's my lineup. So in the comments down below though, leave your favorite. Let me know. Till the next one, you know what to do. Eat good, live well. Stay true.